Hey, my name is Kina Grannis, and I am a singer-songwriter from Los Angeles, California. I was always drawn to music, whether it's a thing that I do by myself to feel good or especially lets me connect with other people, which is something that was kind of really hard for me to do for most of my life. If I started writing little songs on piano, and then I played violin for a really long time, and then I went to this choir concert with my family, and I ended up getting really emotional and I like started bawling and ran to the bathroom and my family was like, well, okay, that was weird. And my sister followed me in and she was like, what's wrong? And I didn't know, but I felt like deeply sad and I just like couldn't stop crying. And it dawned on me that I was feeling I, that I needed to sing. In 2007, I found out about this contest, Doritos Crash the Super Bowl, and all you needed was an original song and video, so I entered it. There was like this other commercial, and then it stopped, and then the screen went black, and it was like, Doritos, and then I heard my guitar start. It was a weird thing where I knew from that moment forward that like, I get to do music now. Writing music is interesting for me because it's a very delicate thing. A lot of people can just sit down and decide, I want to write a song, and then they do it. And for me, it needs to be the right place and the right time and the right mindset. I just got to my little cabin in the woods. Look at how beautiful this is. Outside, a lake and trees. I am feeling incredibly grateful. I'm gonna get back to work now. Okay, bye. I was really wanting to make another great music video and I reached out to my friend, Greg Jarden, and he was like, so, okay, I have this idea where basically it'll be stop motion animation with you and jelly beans. Turns out we'd need a quarter of a million jelly beans to do this, which is a lot of jelly beans. He was like, it's probably gonna take three months. And I was like, for a music video, that's kind of crazy. We would work six to eight hour days. And at some point, Greg was like, so actually it might take like six months. And I was like, that is a long time, but we're, we're in it, let's do it. And then kind of like the year mark passed. And at one point I'm going, am I gonna be doing this for the rest of my life? And I had kind of loosely calculated it. And I was thinking that maybe we're looking more at two years, but that seemed crazy. I was like, I'm sure we're almost done. Um, yeah, it took 22 months. <laughs> we premiered the video and then it went live online. We woke up the next morning and it was like on Good Morning America or something and it was just kind of going viral and within a week Ellen called and was like, let's get her on the show. And so it was a crazy, crazy whirlwind. Creative flow. It's that moment where everything else shuts off. You can't worry about things anymore. You can't be stressed about things. You are 100% present and it feels really, really good. To anyone trying to pursue their passion for your own sanity and happiness, you need to try. Really pour everything you have into it. Take a lot of chances and just go for it. <laughs>